Okay, all right. <laughs> it is see-through. See, it was a lion. <laughs> Hey guys, we're going behind the scenes POV on our shoot with Ang Herod today. Ang Herod is one of those models that start off like a colleague and then end up your friend. I just love her energy on shoots. We're heading to West Edmonton Mall for the shoot, so let's get started. I know, yeah. like the back of my hand. Okay, important. so you know where the arcade is then? Yes, right? yeah. At the, yeah, in yeah. the food court. So I was like, oh, I'll bring this. Oh, I'll bring this. We had a fun time yeah. choosing outfits. I love when models come with their entire closet in a bag. We went with three outfit choices, which is how many I usually choose for my shoots gives us a great amount of variety. Let's take a picture. So I have, because I don't know kind of what you're looking for, but I have a, like a tight like bodycon oh, dress. I love that. It's like um like a frog kind of like green. Okay. Frog green. Okay. I don't know. Okay, okay. So there's that. Yeah. It's almost like kind of like very businessy looking. Yeah. Heels. These are my like stripper heels. Mm -hmm. And then I did bring like it's a skirt, but it's a high-low, so it kind of like cuts across and then kind of hangs low in the back. That's awesome too, I love that. And I have a hair roller because my cat, I'm sorry. So it's kind of, that's the skirt. Sweet, okay. I could kind of roll this up and then they're kind of my gubs would kind of be hanging up. Um, these are just, these are like high-waisted shorts. These are gubs? My gubs. What are gubs? Gubs. <laughs> oh, okay. Is that the British slang? Oh, I don't know. No. <laughs> Maybe. Is it? Okay. <laughs> I just need to know. My chubs. Chubs? My chubby gubs. Okay. All right. I was like, what the heck? That sounded like a, a British thing. <laughs> I know. Sometimes I say shit and people are like, what the fuck is that? Is that British? I'm like, I don't know. And then I asked my mom. She's like, yeah, that's British. I'm like, oh, oopsie. <laughs> I don't even know anymore. Like, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> I don't know if this would be too much of It's kind of like a short jacket, too. Mm -hmm. Do you want to do a dress? Oh, for sure. Okay, I would say the frog dress. I call it a frog dress because it looks like little. Yeah. Yeah, awesome. Oh, sweet. Let's do that as well. Okay. I feel so naked in it. So really? really? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I feel like I put it on today. I was like, <laughs> why? <laughs> oh, just because it's so short and so thin. I think it's see through. So, bless your soul when my ass is out. <laughs> but <laughs> we could do this. When I'm walking around, I'll just put a jacket over me and yeah. throw it off. Okay, sounds good. Wanted. Yeah, sounds good. Here's a camera on the ceiling just right over my shoulder so <laughs> you look good everything's so tight <laughs> I know I feel like it looks like a frog because I always think these look like a little we started off shooting in an area with bright overhead light but had to move halfway through because the artificial pot lights were casting strong overhead shadows hmm. you know what come up this way even more even more <laughs> even more keep going <laughs> okay, that's good. Sorry. Good. There, gorgeous. Looking down. <laughs> that's awesome. Love that. Okay, come out towards me just a bit. Keep going. Right up against the rail. No, right here. This one. Keep going. Right here. Right here. Keep going, keep going, keep going. <laughs> keep going! I'm with a toddler. <laughs> okay, right there, that's good. Okay, so lean out. Kick your heel up. Chin up just a bit. Gorgeous. Next, we were planning a long escalator shot. This turned out more difficult than I had expected. I had only brought three lenses, the 85mm, 50mm, and 14mm prime lenses. The 50mm was too close. The 14mm was too wide. In retrospect, the 24mm would likely have been the perfect focal range for what I wanted to achieve. But we still got some amazing shots. 
I wanted to get the lines of the escalator narrowing at the top like a natural frame and leading lines to the model. It was so fun shooting with Aang Hurd on the escalator. We needed a few takes to make this work, and we had to keep going up and down. I'm surprised the mall security didn't stop us. <laughs> okay, all right. <laughs> it is see-through. See, it was a lion. <laughs> That's okay. Is it too much? Then we headed over to Bed Bath & Beyond. The store was closing down, so we wanted to make use of the space while we still could. Leave it to us to shoot in a place that's going bankrupt. I'm good. Do you need anything? No, I need to stop shopping. Yeah? I like that. What about down here? The mirrors? Yeah. That'd be kind of cute. We landed on a sequence of mirrors, which I quite liked, and we kept having to pause as people were walking by. Ang Harrod was a little shy. What shoes do you want? Do you have black ones? Or do, will these go with it? Oh, uh, we can do these ones. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. Move this way. Step into the middle. Act like you're oogling yourself. Oh. Like you're looking at yourself in the mirror. Okay, you're face. okay looking here. <laughs> Chin up. Bring your hair over to your right side there. The other side. The other side. Yeah, good. Yeah, my right. <laughs> Oops. That's perfect, right there. I wish I had lipstick. That's good. Good, good, good. Hold that. Chin up. Then we went over to the arcade and that was the last of our locations. The arcade shopkeeper came up to us as we were just about to shoot and said we have permission to shoot there, which was really cool of her. Definitely check out New Play Arcade in West Edmonton Mall if you ever want a fun place to play. Those guys are so cool. Okay, now get a little closer to it. To it? Yeah. Gorgeous, love this. If you've ever wondered how I light in dark environments, all you need is an LED light to fill in the model. I didn't want to lug around a light stand, which would attract more attention, so I put the light on a selfie stick. In retrospect, that probably caught even more attention. But this is one way that you can run and gun as a photographer if you need to light by yourself. Fabulous. And with that, we wrapped up our shoot. It's so good to see Ang Harrod again, and if you like this BTS, let us know in the comments down below, and we'll make sure we meet up with Ang Harrod again. But she's super busy because she's traveling all the time. And please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already so you don't miss any of our videos. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.